I feel like we still need to kind of like talk a little bit about the circumstances that kept you guys from getting to Cancun. So I was talking to Amber just a little bit on it on the phone, but like originally I was detained. That sucks. She's clear, she's good, but we can't discuss it. If I talk about it, I'll just start crying. You know, the couples are asking a lot of questions about the really tough time that I had experienced. And I'm feeling loved and supported by Tristan because we are having a united front when we're talking about why we didn't make it to the honeymoon. Is your real name Mia? <laughs> like, yeah. are you James Bond or yeah, something? Yeah. <laughs> it's a crazy story. Yeah. One of these days, I'll share everything. Yeah. 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 But not tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Did y'all yeah. end up taking the last names? Oh, I good, didn't. Good question. But I, I mean, yeah, I, I, I had planned going into it not to change my name. Did no. you guys? Did you change? I did. Yeah. You did. But did you change your name? Yeah. You did. You did? I'm oh, the only one that did it. I'm not bothered that Amber didn't change her last name. Um, I think that it was too, it's too big of a decision to make in that moment. I think it's something that we can go do later. I'm gonna see your ring. Closer. I absolutely love it. So it feels weird, like different feeling when you put the ring on, like, that's my wife. I like it a lot. Yeah. And taking care of someone. I like taking care of someone. It makes me a better guy. I love it. So you guys saying I love you? Yes. But uh, I told her there's a difference between loving somebody and being like, she was like, I'm falling in love with you. And I was like, I can't get there yet, so I'm still establishing trust. I don't think the other couples need to know our business. If Tristan has an issue with me, he can come and talk to me directly. Because all of that kind of adds for me just a level of more stress. So damn, have you guys had an argument yet? Issues, but not arguments. Like we haven't gotten mad at each other. They always end really well. Finances, finances. Oh, yeah, finances is easy. Do you cook? No. Oh. Not a chance. Not a chance? My goodness, she doesn't cook either. She's like, I crock pot. <laughs> you guys are like living together. Do you guys do sex? Do sex. Do you guys do sex? It's just not something we're answering. We did have sex. It was good. But it's just the one thing that I want to hold on to as, you know, something private between husband right. and wife. It's like the one private thing we'll have. We've shared a cup of coffee. Now I'm noticing Danielle and Bobby are super private about everything than me and Tristan. So I'm learning like, hey, it's not gonna be good if we try to compare what we want to be private in terms of sex. Like, it's just better to do things our own way. Dave? Amber? Um, we've done the sex, I guess. <laughs> You've done the sex? Was the sex good? Oh, I'm not going into details like that. It's OK. Your face says it all. So do you want to take this, or should I? All you. All me? OK, we do sex <laughs> quite often. Good for you guys. When we wake up in the middle of the night, it's because one of the dogs won't let us go to sleep. <laughs> and we're like, move. Freaking move. You guys are a real married couple. The dogs sleep in bed with you guys? Yeah. His yeah. The dinner was great. I think that we're all great matches just because we're so compatible. We all really like each other, and we all have our own different type of relationship. We're all good, good friends, and it'll be uh, good to see them again soon. Oh, oh family. <laughs>